when do you apply your fungicide, okay? I think it's, I know it's really important, okay? In addition, when I talk to farmers and even some ag retail salesmen, there's some nervousness about how do you identify what growth stage R3 is. And frankly, it is a little bit confusing, okay? So I wanna walk through that today and then follow it up with a couple other important points. So the way you identify growth stage R3 is the first thing you're looking for is the main stem. So in soybeans, you can have some branch stems. So the first thing you wanna do is identify what the main stem looks like. Then you wanna focus on the four uppermost nodes in that main stem, okay? You would start by counting the last leaf that is a true trifoliate and it's open. And so the leaves are not touching. And so the leaves are not touching. So with, with this trifoliate leaves, the leaves are not touching. This trifoliate that's just emerging, they definitely are touching. So you'd start right here with node number one, right there where the leaf, trifoliate leaf meets the main stem. This would be node number two, node number three, and node number four. And by gosh, on node number four, there is a pod that's at least 3 16ths of an inch long. So by definition, this soybean plant is R3. 